Your next lesson is about the discriminant. Alam niyo, alam niyo ba na ang discriminant ay makukuha or nandito sa ating quadratic formula? Ang discriminant na tinatawag natin ay yung nasa loob na expression sa ating square root. We have the b square minus 4ac. Ayan. Ngayon tinatawag natin discriminant. Saan nagagamit si discriminant? Well, ginagamit natin yan to determine the nature of roots ng ating quadratic equation. O, try mo natin mag-solve ng ating discriminant. O, number one tayo. x squared plus 4x plus 4 is equal to 0. Ayan. So, diretso na tayo. Substitute na kagad natin sa ating formula. So, discriminant is equal to 4 square, the b square, minus 4 times, a natin is 1 times, c natin is 4. Ayan. The next, 4 square, 16. Minus 4 times 1, times 4, that is 16. Simplifying, we have 16 minus 16, which is 0. Ah, yan naman yung value ng ating discriminant. Discriminant is equal to 0. Next example tayo. Let's say we have x squared plus 7x plus 10 is equal to 0. Ayan. Formula, then substitute. B square, so 7 square, minus 4 times A natin, 1 times C natin. 7 square, that is 49, minus 4 times 1, 4 times 10, 40. So 4 times, uh, 40, 49 minus 40, that is 9. Yeah. Uh, third tayo, third example. Let's say we have x squared plus 6x plus 3 is equal to 0. Uh, pwede nyo munang i-pause then continue nyo mamaya to verify or to check your answer. Substitute tayo. D is equal to 6 square minus 4 times 1 times 3. 6 square, well, 6 times 6, 36 minus 4 times 1, 4 times 3, 12. Is equal to 36 minus 12, that is 24. So, madali lang si discriminant, ano? Next tayo. Number 4, x squared minus 2x plus 5 is equal to 0. So, d is equal to, substitute natin, negative 2 square minus 4 times c. Uh, a is 1 times c, 5. Negative 2 square, that is 4 minus 4 times 1 times 5, 20 is equal to negative 16. So, pansinin natin yung ating mga discriminant. So, meron tayo itong 0, 9, 24, and negative 16. Then, ngayon, papasok yung ating nature of roots. Sa ating nature of roots, kapag ang discriminant natin, sulat natin, nature of roots. Kapag ang discriminant natin is greater than zero and perfect square, then ang nature niyan ay real, rational, and unequal. 
Major niya, real, rational, and unequal roots. Yan. Kapag naman, ang discriminant natin ay discriminant is greater than zero but not a perfect square. A perfect square. Then, ang roots natin ay real this time, irrational. Irrational. And unequal. Alang ganyan lang din. What if D is equal to zero? Gaya example natin number one. Then, ang ating nature of roots are real. Rational and equal na siya. Pasin nyo dito, yung given natin mismo, perfect square number. O, yun ang lalabas, ang discriminant natin ay 0. At kapag ang discriminant natin is less than 0, that means kapag ang discriminant ay negative numbers, ngayon example number 4 natin, that is, ang major ng rule natin, Nature of roots natin is no real roots. Okay. Diyan papasok yung nature of roots. Kaya mahalaga talaga na alam yung ating discriminant. Ah, mukhang malabo ah. Yeah. So yan ang magiging lesson 5 ninyo. Don't forget to share this video, like and subscribe.